Okay, so hello YouTube. Um, I'm gonna reintroduce myself because my first video was basically a disgrace. Uh, it was low budget. <laughs> Nothing to do with low budget. I'm just using the same camera, so yeah, it's the same budget as before. I just want to reintroduce because I actually really, really, really want to start using my YouTube channel properly. I keep on looking outside, sorry, because things flying past. Uh, but yeah, so I've got. A list here of not that you even saw, not that you can, yeah, but yeah, you can't even see it, but yeah, it's whatever. So, yeah, I'm gonna reintroduce myself, and this time I have a list of things that I can talk about because before I didn't have a list and I was freestyling and I kept on saying, um, I'm probably gonna say, um, about a hundred times in this video anyway, but um, there we go this time it's organized so i'm doing organized um so when i'm umming it's because i'm reading for my list so yes my name my name is kaja kaim lisby my my name i was about to say i did that already age i am 27 i just turned 27 occupation what do i do i work in retail right now um that's not going to be forever I can't do that forever so I won't do that forever but also I am a photographer and I also am a model I will leave my Instagram links in the bio or in the whatever you know YouTube people do this I'll leave them there so yeah I'll leave them there I don't even know what my channel content will be it will be random stuff it could be me one day just blasting something that I saw. It could be me trying to be motivational. I'm not gonna say trying, I'm gonna say it could be me being motivational. That's making a lot of noise. It could be me on a photo shoot because I also want to get into video direction because I just have random thoughts sometimes and I just I just would, would like to put my ideas into movement if that makes any sense so yeah i don't really know what my content of my channel will be but it will just be whatever, 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 whatever. whatever. on the day facts about me um i like to eat i love to eat but, Get out, right now. um interruptions there from my brother great facts about me i don't know i don't you have to ask me a question and I'll be able to answer it. I don't know what to say about myself. I'm, I'm tall. I'm a black person. Yeah, that's about it. My Instagram, as I said, I'll leave that in the, the down there. Uh, Favourite food? I love pizza. I literally just ate pizza about five minutes ago from NY Folds. It was amazing. Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. I just got margarita because I'm not really into like all these and I don't eat pork and like majority of their pieces not majority I'm gonna say that before they come for me but a lot of the pieces have pork in it I don't eat pork um I just choose not to eat pork just because pigs are pigs and yeah they're pigs favorite game um I'll say my favourite game. Okay, I'm going to go back in the day. So, when I was a child, my favourite game was Dance Map. All them step step. I loved all of that. Like, I actually bought myself a Dance Map on Christmas and gifted it to myself. I wrapped it and everything. I played it first, of course. Uh, then wrapped it. And wrote on the box to Kaj from Kaj, you'll love it. Opened it and then acted surprised on Christmas. This time I bought it for myself, loser. But either way, that was my favourite game. Uh what else is my favourite game? Tekken. Any number, Tekken, tag team, one, Tekken three, Tekken four, five, six, Tekken, however many Tekkens there are. I haven't even played Tekken. I haven't played Tekken six, I don't think I have. 
I don't think I have, that's really bad actually. I had to call myself a fan of Tekken, but I haven't even played Tekken 6 or... Is there a 7? I feel like there is a 7. I haven't even played Tekken 7, whatever Tekken number there is on PlayStation 3 and PlayStation 4. I don't have those consoles, so yeah, I haven't played them. But I've played all the way up to 5 and I enjoy Tekken 5 greatly. Tekken 4, amazing. Tekken 3, great because it had that ball game thing and I really really like that ball game thing um, and it had the dinosaur gone gone he gone was good he was a bit short a little bit annoying because all he could do is low moves it's not everyday low moves but sometimes high moves but yeah he was good I think yeah I'm gonna stop rambling so yeah those are my favorite games favorite music <sighs> okay so my favorite music is 90s hip hop and R&B all the way I was born in the 90s I'm a 90s baby everything 90s I love it um, anything I can do this to I never knew there was a love. anything I can do that to and you know the the crisscross with a that I love that. like anything anything 90s I love a bit of I'm trying to think what now is my favourite 90s song Get it. No, I don't think I even have a favorite nighty song. It's just anything that I can just I can get down to. That's my my favorite. Right now, um, I'm listening to. Can you satisfy me? Can you surprise me? I listen to just random stuff. I download a lot of music and then just listen to my. I, on shuffle a lot of this new music I don't really listen to and I only really listen to it if it's just being played and then sometimes I like it sometimes I don't but most of the time I'm just listening to my iPod listening to my 90s hip hop and R&B uh, my Erica Badu my Angie Stones uh, Beyonce D'Angelo Bruno Mars Miguel Usher and can I say for a second, Usher, can we actually put some respect on Usher's name? Because Usher is actually amazing. He's a great singer, great dancer, but all these herpes rumours, let's throw them to the side because it's not the truth, okay? Okay? Throw it. Thank you. I'm half Nigerian, half Jamaican, but the Nigerian accent is just, it's just my favourite, you know? I just like to do it, you know? Sometimes I would just, you know, I like to do the American Nigerian accent, you know, sweetie, you know, that's how we do, darling, darling, yeah, um, so I'm going to stop that now, but yeah, I, I just like to do that. Favourite shows, right now, I would say Insecure, 100% Insecure, if you haven't watched Insecure, watch Insecure, it's great. But education, I went to university and I graduated three years, wow, shocking. I graduated three years ago from photography. What can I say about uni? Uni was an experience. I've always wanted to go to uni. I'm just checking that I'm still recording. I am still recording. I always wanted to go to uni from when I was a child because I thought that university was going to be the way it was on TV and those American TV shows where you're living in uni and there's like people just down, down there, or people, people living on your left, people living on your right and you know they knock on your door and like hey man where are you going tonight um, and then I ended up just staying at home for uni because I went to university in London, I went to Middlesex University a uh, great university, I learned a lot and I would say that I wouldn't be the photographer that I am, not to say that I'm so great and was so, or that I'm so amazing, but I wouldn't be the photographer that I am if I didn't go to uni. University is expensive, but I would say for anyone that wants to go to uni, go to uni because you may go and realise that this isn't for you or you may go and realise that this is everything that I wanted or you may go and be like, like this isn't what it's like in America but I'm still going to stay here anyway because I'm learning a lot which is how I felt about university favourite quotes I would say this is it this is it people always say to me why do you always say this is it because this is it 
this is it goes with everything. The, the pizza was nice. This is it. That person's getting on my nerves. This is it. It's cold. This is it. Oh, I'm sweating. This is it. This is it. It goes with everything. This is it. And I have some throwback ones that I haven't used in a long time. Like, look at your lips. Imagine you're on the street and somebody's cussing you out and they just say to you, look at your lips. You're going to be like, is there something on my lips? Like, you're going to feel like, oh my gosh, my lips. There's probably more. And I'll end up saying them in my future videos. But for now, this is it. And look at your lips. The strong quotation. Look at your lips. This is it. Yeah, I think I'm done. If anybody has any questions, please ask in the comments. And that is all. So, peace out. A town down. You won't remember anything. When you wake up, you just, you just redo things. <laughs>